Hello, welcome back. This is Kenshin1913, and we're Let's Playing Dragon Warrior 3. In the last episode, we explored J Jaipan and, um, and the Shrine of Dharma, which we are at. So, yes, you can, um, in the, between episodes, I went back and I bought a lot of nice things for our heroes. I bought the zombie slasher. You know what? Let's just show you the stats. I bought a zombie slasher, a magic armor, and an iron mask for our soldier. Uh, same thing for the hero. He's got some. He went up a level. Uh, and for our uh, pilgrim, a zombie slasher and a magic armor. Now, I had a lot of money in my in the vault. So I was able to I was able to use some of that in order to help get the equipment. That's why I'm I didn't go up many levels. Anyways, like I was saying in the last episode, you know this is a place where you can come and change professions. Uh, see, he's even full soldier status. You gotta wait till you're in level 20. Yeah, and so basically you can customize your your heroes the, uh, whatever way you want so if you wanted it's just really cool how you can do it and it, so if you wanted like your pilgrim to become a fighter you know you can level him up a bunch I, I'd say don't do it right at level 20 just because you know you won't have a lot of uh, magic you, you'll lose half your MP of what you have right now so like say uh, my pilgrim he wanted to become a fighter, his HP would be slashed, all these stats would be slashed in half. But he'd keep all these spells. But he wouldn't have a lot of MP to use, like if he wanted to be a fighter or a soldier or something. And like I said in the last episode, there's one item that can change any cl any class into a sage without having to be a goof off. Oh, here we go, some nebs and a metal slime. Anyways, that item is the Book of Satori, or the Book of Sages, whatever. Anyways, we get, we're going to go on a quest to get that. And we're going to turn one of our characters into a sage. Ah, well. Nothing you can do about that. Yeah. Where we can turn our characters into a sage, some new, more new enemies, uh, is in the tower uh, north. I don't know what the tower is called. Uh, I'm not exactly sure. But we'll call it the Tower of Satori since uh, that's where the sage book is. And like I said, you know, you might not want to change your class right away as soon as you hit 20. Oh, nice, our wizard went up a level. Just due to the fact that their stats will be rather low. I'd say probably wait till like, level 30. But then again, I'm not gonna heed my own advice, so... Do what you want. Alright. Yeah, see? If we possess the Book of Satori, we can become a sage. Without being a goof-off. Oh boy, great beaks. I think these guys attack twice. A real P in the A. But luckily we have a... Uh, a wizard. And our firebane spell works pretty good. And we got all new armor. Unlike... You know, Dragon Warrior 1 and... The magic armor doesn't heal your MP as you walk. Or HP as you walk. Oh, this is the Tower of Garuna. Thank you. Oh, here's a warp. I'm gonna see if I can try to get it... Get the... The book... In this video, but I don't think I will. Uh, I think I remember where to go, but... I'm not sure. Oh, here's an old man. 
No, I'll be quiet. Hold oh, man. So, like I said in the probably the second video, you know, Sages are an awesome class. They're pretty. They're pretty strong. You know, they got fairly decent uh, attack power. They, you know, they learn both sets of spells, Wizard and Pilgrim. So that's pretty. That's friggin' awesome. They got a good amount of HP. Oh, here's another enemy, the Simiac. They got a fairly good amount of HP, good MP, obviously, since they'll be using both spells. They're just, uh, you know, pretty good all around. And I'm gonna make one of my characters into them. I'm not gonna tell you yet. And I, I decided I want to do something a little different with this LP. Normally I don't make a certain character in this song, but I'm going to do it for this one. Just to add a little more, uh, you know, just to add a little variety in, uh, you know, my characters. Um, I guess it's not really variety. Anyways, you want to go into that, that thing, and now we're walking on like a rope. We're tight rope walkers. Oh, here's a new enemy, a sky dragon. These guys can be a pain because they breathe fire. Yep. And fire hurts big time. I forget if in this game we get a spell that diminishes the effects of fire. Of fire breathing enemies. I think we do, but I'm not sure. But in other games they eventually give you an attack that, no, you know. That lessens the damage of that. Cause, it, oh man. Some monsters, they can just hit you so bad. Whoops. My pilgrim's pretty talented if you can, uh, uh, if you can cast heal more on, on a tightrope. Must be pretty good. Must have been uh, circus performers in their past lives. I mean, cause that's why I hear it's pretty hard to walk on a tightrope, you know what I mean? Alright, now here we're gonna wanna go, I believe, in the center one. Stairs, I mean. And here I think we're gonna go down. And up. Now I think in the um just coming in this tower reminds me of something. In the Game Boy Advance version of this game. You can actually this this game the game actually connects with the other games in the series. I'm not gonna explain it now, but I'll tell you when the time comes. And what is this? Iron helmet. We already have a... Uh, Iron masks, which are much better. Oh boy. I'm gonna keep showing the battles with the metal slimes. Oh no, this isn't the way. In case we do kill one. Be very careful on this, because if you fall, you're pretty much screwed. I think you're supposed to fall. No, maybe it's a different cave tower I'm thinking of. You're supposed to fall. Hmm. Numbness has gone away. Hooray. Alright, let's try the top. No. This tower can get confusing. Hmm. I'm thinking maybe you have to fall. Oh, money. Hmm, I'm pretty sure you're gonna have to fall. On that tightrope. Uh oh. Now 
I didn't get to show you these battles last time due to the fact that I was an idiot. And I forgot to uh, record. Oh, great. But yeah, these guys hit hard. Real hard. And luckily, we also hit hard now. Don't. Oh, man. What the hell? My wizard can't stop dying. And we go up a level. Nice. I learned a new spell. Let's check it out really quick. Nope, nothing here. I was hoping it would be revive or something, but nope. Alright, well, we'll get the Book of Satori in the next episode. This is Kenshin1913 saying see you later.